The World Health Organization has stressed the need to contain a growing monkeypox outbreak, saying that this can be easily achieved through swift and immediate action. WHO also warns that there will be community spread, but it says that the pace of that spread will be slow, so there is currently no strong need for mass immunization. Now, this comes as Finland confirms its first case of the virus, adding to some 300 confirmed and suspected cases in some 20 nations, the bulk of them in Europe. The spreading infections have triggered alarm, as the disease had mostly been confined to West and Central Africa. And for more, Rosie Bircher joins us live from Brussels. Rosie, the WHO, certain that monkeypox outbreaks, that they can be contained. What needs to be done, though? Well, the WHO said that this outbreak, this multi-country outbreak, is unusual. And Dr Sylvie Briand, who was there briefing member countries, said that, in fact, this the number of cases detected so far may just be the tip of the iceberg. But she was also clear in her message that this is not an infection or a virus that the, the general public should be worried about because it does not spread as easily, for example, as COVID-19. It mainly spreads through skin-to-skin -skin contact. That's why WHO officials are recommending that governments take measures such as contact tracing, case investigation and isolation. They also would like to see member countries trying to raise awareness among groups which might be more at risk when it comes to transmission, for example, healthcare or lab workers. And they've asked governments to keep communicating clearly to make sure that certain sections of the population do, are not stigmatised. Well, Rosie, the WHO has also urged caution uh, in using vaccines or even treatments for monkeypox. Uh, but the EU is reportedly looking into a common purchase of vaccines against the virus. So why, why uh, are they taking that approach? It's an interesting question. It's one that is being discussed behind closed doors among EU member states now and in the coming few days. The WHO, as you said, was quite unequivocal in its recommendations. It said there is absolutely no recommendation for a mass vaccine rollout. The European Commission, that's headquartered in the building behind me, says that while the bloc is looking into joint vaccine purchases and procurements also of therapeutics, there is no plan to do any sort of widespread rollout across the general population. Now, the WHO has also recommended, says that there is no recommendation to use smallpox vaccines against monkeypox, but it does say that there could be some exceptions, exceptions to that. Overall, we see WHO officials really recommending also that there is an acceleration of research on monkeypox and officials and experts from the countries where the virus is endemic are due to brief their counterparts from other countries to try and speed up and accelerate research here and help governments try and contain this disease. But as you rightly said, quite an unequivocal message from the WHO that there should be no mass vaccination rollouts against monkeypox. Mm, this certainly remains one to watch. Rosie, thank you very much for that. Rosie Burchard in Brussels.